Hey guys, welcome to tonight's extra video. We are in the truck. We're just getting ready to go into the barn. And it is lesson day, you guys. We brought Gracie. I'm super excited to see how she does. You guys know how sometimes with horses there's like a honeymoon period and then it all breaks loose? Yeah, I'm worried about that. All right, so we're a little early. Why the heck are we so early? Why are we always early? Last week, Sophie didn't ride because she was sick. And what you guys didn't see was that Brandon put on the board beside her name a new horse to ride. So we're gonna check right now and see who she's riding. She was supposed to ride a different horse last time. I forgot to go back and help. I told him that I was bringing all my stuff in and I'd come back and help. That was a good horse, Dad. This is all the stuff I carried. All right, Sophie, I checked the board. You're riding somebody new. Yeah, we figured. Oh, all right, well, do you have a light? No, I don't. Oh, good. She's got a light. All right, let's go. I'll come with you. We might need help. We are going to need help. All right, here we go. Oh, there's a puddle. The arena is all lit up, though. That moment you ride a new horse, it's like, I know. Sophie's ridden this horse before, and she doesn't really love it. Sophie prefers a gelding, for sure. But... Stallion. I don't like stallions either. They're too much. Yeah, not a stallion. So, Sophie found these in her locker. We need to clean out her locker and get it all freshened up. Also, my jump boots are in there. I want to use them, but I don't think they'll fit her. Oh, yeah. So, anyways, she found these. We bought these for Finn. We forgot about them. They're like leg wraps. They're basically polo wraps. But they're not really. They're, not they're just decorative. So, like, who are we going to put that on? Gracie. No, not tonight. Give them to me and I'm going to wash them. But for the Santa Claus parade, they'll be perfect. So, let's see who Sophie's going to ride tonight. Is it... Gracie? That's Gracie. Nope. Is it... Chino Bambino? Nope. He's like, let me choose something. Is it Watcha? Wow, what is Watcha wearing? A cooler because she I thought she was gonna get cool. Yeah, see Sophie misses this being able to like love on a horse it and take cool care of her. But this cooler it was Finn's. She won it for Finn. And it says Reserve Champion Jumper Division. I love that. Anyway, this is her horse. This is her new horse for the day. And probably maybe for a while, we don't know. So another thing. Alright. Sophie just asked Brandon, can I ride in my own saddle? Like she loves her saddle. It used to slippery and it's just too grippy. So anyway, he said, yeah, you can use your saddle because she's a bigger horse and it's like a bigger, so he's gonna check it, make sure it's fine. It's not gonna be too small. If anything, it'll be too big. And if it is too big, then we will use, <gasps> where's your saddle pad? Already up there. Oh, okay. Oh, you mean the half pad is up there. Oh, okay, yeah, like. Can you move the girth for a second? Yeah, hold on. <sighs> Hold on, this bad boy, which I've been dying to use. It is a CWD half pad and it's shimmable, but the shims are so super cool. It has wither relief and it actually is like the coolest one that we've ever had. And then I got my jump boots. Yeah, let's take all this stuff home. Well, I wanna, I wanna see if these fit, but Watcher probably isn't used to them. They and probably won't fit Watcher because they're so skinny. Well, that's not your first oh, no, ride. I thought these were chance. Yeah, let's not stress her out the first time you ride. So put those away, and if you like her this time and you ride her again, then you can bring them out, okay? I don't know if I'll fit her though, because she has wider legs. All right, bring them out. If you want to try them, we'll try them. So, well, she doesn't need that. That's my favorite shedding blade though. So, one thing. Another hoof pick. One thing. Four hoof picks? So this, those, <laughs> there's all the hoof picks. Those are mine. Every day I'm like, where's the hoof pick? But look at this thing. I love this. So this is like a little thing that we got. I think, a, I think a, a subscriber sent this to us. Can you pull it? No, it doesn't pull. But anyways, you hook it to your trailer. You carry it in your bag and you hook it to anything. And then it becomes like a breakaway tie for your horse. So keep that in there. Like... I'm excited to take all Sophie's stuff home. It's super cool. All right, come on, let's go. Wait, I've got more stuff in my Hello, Gabby. All right, come on, let's go. I so even though this is not Sophie's actual horse, it feels like getting a new horse, trying a new horse. 
learning a new horse. Someone stepped on it. That was probably me. So she'll probably ride Denver again. But he wants her to try her. He's been wanting to, her to try her for a while now. I've been wanting to not try her. For and so he's been wanting to not try her because her confidence comes in what she knows and feels safe on. Let's try this baby. Put the saddle on and we'll get Brandon to check it for us. So this is the saddle that Sophie num usually rides in. It is number nine and it is the one that fits her the best at the barn. And this is like a left-in saddle. This is Sophie's custom saddle. Put that around. Oh, okay. I'll flip it around. Because it looks unnatural. So this is Sophie's custom saddle. It's her dream saddle. Sophie's already lunging Gracie a little. Just that Brandon's like, why, why? Look, look at her. She's so calm. She's so quiet. Brandon's like, why are you lunging her? Just jump on and go. But we're like overprotective parents. And Chino's happy. He loves having her here. You see how he watches her? He stares at her and watches her. How do you think Duke will be? I don't think he's ever seen a small one. <laughs> and yeah, he's looking. He's very confused. <laughs> Whoa. It, oh my god, I'm moving away. He's like, it moves. <laughs> All right. We'll just have to take extra precautions. Just until, like, Duke gets used to it. Give her lots of rope there, Sophie. Just We'll just take precautions until Duke gets used to her. But yeah, she seems kind. She, she seems quiet again. He likes small things. Desi, so does Chino love small things. Yeah, maybe he'll like her. But he's he's watching. His I nose is flaring. <laughs> and Chino's sleeping. Chino loves her. Watcha. Beautiful watcha. You ready? And she's already calm. She's not forward? She's more forward. Oh, oh she's more forward? That's what you like, forwardness. Just, all right, so we've been just chatting with other moms, but Gracie's down there looking gorgeous and amazing and relaxed and loving it. Like, I feel like she loves this now. I feel like she didn't know what she was giving up when she didn't love lessons before. And then Sylvie on her new horse. So there's that. I feel a lot more relaxed, knock on wood. Like... I don't have to watch Gracie the whole time, but I want to watch Gracie the whole time because she's adorable. She does not seem spooky. She does not seem forward. She just seems calm. Yeah, he's trying to catch up to her. He's like, I will find you, little girl. <laughs> Finally, somebody he likes. He's like, please. <laughs> Look at those ears. I think Sophie's a little nervous. She's holding up the whole line. New horses are nerve wracking. Can't wear pink anymore. Because pink on a chestnut? I love a chestnut. All right, go. I got you. I'm watching you. There we go. I'd run a thousand miles if I could run with you. Sophie loves her saddle. Yeah. I know, it's such a nice saddle. And from what I have heard, you do the same thing too. I wanna say forever, we could be good together. Guess misery loves company. Better to late than never. You know we could do better. So take a chance and run with me. Everywhere we go. You're dying? Yeah, she hasn't ridden that much. Like, she missed two lessons, and normally we never miss lessons. Like, ever. Balancing, nice straight line. I feel like we did this exercise last week over there. 
but I love flat lessons. Like I love them doing so much flat. I was telling Julia that Gracie's like a seasoned show, a uh, seasoned lesson pony. Uh, it's like came I'm like you know we should feed her because then she's gonna not be hungry and act bad but really she needed fault oh. Julia we fed her oh it's been a long time I was on the sideline waiting for you we could go to California yeah. 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 there we go yeah. one more time she's easy to see because it's Things on horses. We don't like flaw. Law is bad. Good. Let's find something That moment when your coach says, I'm gonna yell at you for something, what is it? And then you list like a whole list of things. And then your coach says, yeah, fix them all. It's a trick, you know? Canter smooth. I don't like a jump. You don't like a jump a lot. It's just because you have to get used to it. You have to figure each other out. She's listening to you. I bet you if you listen to Brandon, put your leg on more, she'll jump better, more smoothly. Lesson, guys. 
Keep in mind that Sophie's learning on a new horse or she rode a different horse, a totally different ride for her and she just said they have to get used to each other. And these guys are all learning. They're all learning how to ride. They're having fun and they're enjoying their riding lessons. I don't know if I've told you guys, but I'm pretty sure I told you guys that we decreased our lessons through the winter just like the deep part of the winter like where it's really cold like now till like the end of february probably um till once a week and then we'll go back to twice a week it's such a different experience we've always ridden twice a week at least or more and going down to one has been such a different difference in riding i noticed that it has had an effect on the girls and uh, but it also has had an effect where like we're so excited to go to the bar now instead of it being almost like a chore being at the barn three times a week before so having the horses at home have been has been really amazing and being able to ride with all of our friends has been really fun too don't you know that you